How's it going guys? In today's lesson we're going to be looking at how we can extract text from PDF files and print it in the console so we can later process that text and use it however we please. And it's going to be compatible with any kind of PDF file. So for example, I have this one that is just a coffee PDF. It's about coffee, lots of data about coffee. And I also have another one which is a sample PDF, which is a bit more simple so that we can actually see what we're extracting. And when we actually go ahead and run this program, we're going to start with the sample.pdf, which is the easy one. And we're going to get all the text printed to the console. As you can see, we have all of it inside here. So we can just process that later in any way we please. Now we can also do it with the coffee PDF. And if we run that, we're going to get a much longer page with all the PDF information. So again, once you extract this information, you can use it in any way you need to. So it can be really good for making some quick searches in PDF files and for making it a lot easier to use regex. So that's what we're going to be building in this lesson. So go ahead and create a new empty Python project. And I'm just going to create a new file here. And the only thing you need to do ahead of time is go ahead and find a PDF file that you want to test, such as a sample PDF or a coffee PDF or any PDF you want. You just need to make sure that this is physical text and not an image. This is not image recognition, it is just text extraction. So find some PDF files that you want to extract the text from and just place it inside your Python project. Next, you want to go ahead and open up the terminal and type in pip install pi pdf2. And here we're going to go ahead and import pi pdf2 just the way it is. And we're going to create a function called extract text from pdf, which will take a PDF file of type string. And it's going to return to us an array of strings. Now, the first thing we need to do is open the file. So with open PDF file, and we want to read this as bytes. So we will add this RB string and we want to import it as a PDF. Now the reader is going to equal a PI PDF2 and we need the PDF file reader, which is going to take a PDF and we're going to set strict to false. Next, we need to go ahead and create a list of the PDF text that we're going to extract from this PDF file. And for each page in the reader.pages, we're going to extract the text. So content is going to equal the page.extract underscore text. And we want to go ahead and call PDF text dot append. And we want to append the content. Then we will just go ahead and return this PDF dot text. And that's all we need to do to extract the information from the PDF file and add it to a list so we can use it later. Then we're going to go ahead and create a main check. And inside here, we're going to go ahead and get the text. So extracted text is going to equal extract text from PDF. And inside here, you can insert your PDF file. I'm just going to be using the sample PDF from earlier. And for each text in this array, we're going to go ahead and print that text. So now if we go ahead and click on run, we're going to be able to extract the text from the file. And this is going to work also for the coffee text. As you can see, we have all the text from the coffee PDF. And as I mentioned earlier, you can add whatever kind of processing you want. I definitely recommend you do something such as use regex and we actually have to import regex for that. So with this line of code, we're just going to recognize words as they are without punctuation. So if it says hello with an exclamation mark, it's going to remove the exclamation mark. So we just get the word hello back. And with this being done, we can go ahead and make some very simple checks, such as if the word coffee is in the split message array, then we can go ahead and say coffee count plus equals one. And we need to create that above as well. So coffee counts is going to equal zero initially. And at the end of this, we can say something such as coffee found. And we're just going to go ahead and insert the coffee count. Now when we go ahead and run this, it's going to check all the coffee instances in the PDF and it's going to find it 151 times in the coffee PDF file. So you can do some simple checks like that. You can aggregate data that you want. All you need to do is make sure that you create some sort of regex and 
that will make it a lot easier to process the text from the PDF file. But otherwise going to the original, all you have to do is insert the PDF of your choice. And that's going to return to you an array of all the pages that were inside the PDF as text files. So it was that simple to create text from PDF files in Python. And as always guys, I hope this tutorial helped. Otherwise, I will see you guys in the next lesson.